Yeah, Cher, while the general feeling up here is one of optimism, you have to keep in mind that two families actually lost their homes to this fire, so the impact of it has been profound. And like yesterday, the heat again today, a huge factor. I'm just kind of taking this all in right now. It's kind of devastating. I think I'm still in shock. Chris Burkhead looks over the remains of his charred trailer here on Ridge Route Road in Castaic, one of two residents who lost their homes in the route fire. But Burkhead also lost his best friend, 15-year-old Honeybee. I miss my dog like crazy. I can't believe what happened. I can't believe what happened, man. Too late for some, but firefighters were able to get the upper hand on the blaze today, keeping it at just over 5,200 acres, but improving containment to nearly 30 percent. It's tough. It's hot. You, sh you know, you're sweating a lot. It's uh, it definitely, uh, it, takes, it takes its toll on you. Captain Mark Serby and his strike team from the Pismo Beach area were out there on the fire line today, dealing with a 113 degree temperature. Staying hydrated, keeping the guys, uh, you know, making sure they got enough work rest periods to, uh, we don't want any uh, heat related emergencies or issues with, with my crews. Same is true for the entire fire command. Eight firefighters were sickened by the heat yesterday, so chiefs started cycling manpower through the lines today. Kind of rotating people in and out of those dangerous hot areas. So we're managing those resources wisely and giving them a chance to rest and then getting them right back in there. And good news from the 5 freeway. Scores of big rigs and cars trapped when the flames forced the closure of the north-south artery on Wednesday finally hit the road again when four lanes were reopened earlier in both directions. And a mixture of good and bad news then up here in Castaic. The homes were lost, as we mentioned before, but the evacuations were lifted earlier today. The freeway now, for the most part, open in both directions, and firefighters are hoping, anyway, to gain more ground by tomorrow. In Castaic, I'm Rick Chambers. Guys, let me throw it back to you in Hollywood. Rick.